Hi guys and welcome back to Machine Learning Libraries with C++ where we're dealing with machine learning libraries and we're currently on section 3 where we're looking at MLPack. So in this section we're going to be taking a look at, it's going to be a very similar format to the last section with Shark. We're going to be setting up MLPack and then, but instead the example we're going to be looking at is k-means um, as opposed to linear regression but k-means we went over in the first product so you should be more or less up to scratch with how that works and the actual implementation of how you implement k-means and how it works in practice. We'll then also in the standard way be going on to look at some library specific features of MLPack. So firstly we need to get installed with MLPack so environment setup and in this video very simply we're going to be looking at installing MLPack We'll also go over how you can compile your ML programs and link to the libraries later on in this video. So, as with all machine learning libraries or with all libraries, C++ libraries, there are dependencies and, you know, MLPack is no exception to that rule. But MLPack relies on Boost and Armadillo. Um, so Boost, as you know, there's some maths functions available and file system stuff that it um, is very useful for. Armadillo, um, a lot of you might have not have heard of, it's basically like a data container class. So it's very useful for holding the data um, and it is effectively a bit like, yeah, it's a, you can just think of it as a container library. Um, MLPack interfaces very nicely with it and we will be using a lot of Armadillo types in uh, when you use MLPack. But again, fortunately all dependencies for Boost and Armadillo are available as binaries with your Linux distribution. So you can just go ahead and install them using your package manager. So you can just do apt get install and then install all the relevant ones. So it's just Boost and Armadillo are the main ones. And yeah, want, and then you don't have to worry about install where you're installing them. I mean, if you want, you can install them from source or if you've already got them installed, that's completely fine. But if you haven't, just go ahead and run that command and everything should all be fine. And then in a similar fashion, there's also a binary available for MLPack. So you can just download it using your package manager as well. Super, super easy. Uh, you don't have to worry about where you're installing your files, whether it's, you know, system wide, whatever, whatever, or whatever. But yeah, I mean, also, if you want, you can compile from source. There's nothing against that. It is recommended. But for just getting up to speed and getting into scr up to scratch, just installing the binary is perfectly suitable and that's what I've done for these examples. So how do we compile our program? Well, obviously we need to include our relevant header files, um, but we also need to include Armadillo and Boost if we're using it in our program. But a lot of the MLPack files will, all, will include Boost where it's relevant and where it's necessary. But then to compile, you know, we need to link with C++11 that's almost standard now, but we'll also need to link with Armadillo and Boost as well as MLPack. So if you're using GCC or Clang, you can just link in the following way. But if you're using CMake, you're going to need to um, find the package and then link to that specific library. So you do find package and then target link libraries off the top of my head. Um, you shouldn't have any problems really with that. I'm just kind of being explicit as to how you do it. So that's pretty much it. I hope you know you can install boot um, ML pack now on your system um, and it'd be completely fine. I'm sure Windows isn't too difficult either. I imagine it's quite straightforward, um, but obviously we're focusing on Linux here. But yeah, so I hope you know you find that relatively intuitive and you can install ML pack without any problems. There shouldn't be any problems, but sometimes there are. <laughs> 